if you ever want to succeed in life, then believing in yourself and in your abilities is a great place to start because your inner faith will create that external result. In this video, I'm going to share five tips that you can start implementing today in order to improve your self-belief. Coming after this. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, you're absolutely welcome. My name is Uma Afodile. I am a personal development enthusiast. And on this channel, I teach and inspire people to develop themselves in order to improve their quality of life and contribute to realization of dreams and aspirations one video at a time. It is easy to doubt yourself when you failed too many times, but failure is never the end of the road. But you have to believe in that for it to be true. So the first tip that I'm sharing is to accept your life in its current state. You will do yourself no good if you're constantly fighting what your life is right now. Whatever your current reality is, you have to accept that. Stop living in denial just because you're not where you want to be. Remember, there's always room for improvement. But if you don't accept where you are now, it is difficult for you to get to where you want to go. Also, if you don't accept where you are now, you will feel frustrated, you will, you will lack belief, you will even feel demotivated to take action or to take steps towards where you want to go. So you have to accept your current reality and where you are in your life right now and then work towards where you want to be. The second tip I'm sharing is to remember your past successes. Let's face it, life is hard but I don't think it was ever intended to be hard. You just have to know how to navigate through life with realistic expectations and you will not be so disappointed. Another thing is sometimes life can get so overwhelming and so complicated and so difficult, it becomes easy for you to doubt yourself and your abilities. But honestly, no matter how much failure you've experienced in your lifetime, I am pretty sure there is one time or two times you have experienced successes. You have experienced a win. You have experienced a victory over your challenges. So think about those times when you have experienced success and how did you feel about that? How did you feel when you experienced those successes? Call back those feelings, recall those feelings, bask in those feelings, feel those feelings all over again. And it will help to boost your confidence. It will help to give you motivation to keep on going. And that way you will believe in yourself more. In a nutshell, use your past successes as an advantage to propel yourself forward and to propel yourself into believing in yourself more. No matter how many failures you've had, Remember the successes and how that felt for you and relieve those experiences again And I'm telling you it's going to give it's going to give you a boost in your self-belief The top tip I'm sharing is to trust yourself. You got this. You can do this Believe in yourself. Trust in yourself. Trust in that thing that makes you you. Is it your courage? Is it your bravery? Is it your strength? Is it in your ability to see the good and the bad? Whatever it is that makes you you, whatever it is that reflects your best qualities, call upon those things and trust in the abilities of those things to help you move forward in life. Spend a good amount of time with yourself assessing these qualities that makes you you, these qualities that makes you unique. So whether it's your bravery, whether it's your courage, whether it's the way you listen to people, whether it's Whatever it is that makes you, you. Spend a good amount of time assessing those qualities. And you can do this by journaling. You can do this by engaging in activities that brings out those qualities. And use that to build back your belief in yourself. So if you are the type that have a strong self-discipline, if you are the type that have a strong self-control, engage in activities that help those qualities to shine. Engage in activities that will help those qualities to grow even stronger and that will help you to build your self-belief because when you see yourself doing well because of those qualities, it will register in your mind that, well, 
I am good at this. And if you constantly tell yourself you are good at something, it builds your self-belief. Remember that trusting yourself is one of the best ways to get back your self-belief. Because honestly, if you don't trust yourself, who is going to trust you? You have to trust yourself. Everything good that you want out of life is going to have to start with you. So if you want other people to believe in you, then you have to start by believing in yourself. If you want other people to trust you, then you have to start by trusting yourself. Okay, so go ahead, trust yourself and see how that will help to improve your self-belief. The fourth tip I'm sharing is to face your fear. Listen, fear is the single most dangerous thing that holds us back from reaching our full potential. If you've ever allowed fear to cripple you, to overwhelm you, to stop you from taking action or grabbing opportunities, you are going to constantly live in self-disbelief. So don't let your fear tell you what to do. Don't let your fear dictate for you what actions you should take. Don't let your fear stop you from chasing your dreams because if you let that happen, you would live in constant disbelief. Always ask yourself, what is the worst thing that could happen if you choose to face your fear? The worst thing that could happen is that you don't take action. The worst thing that could happen is that you let that opportunity go because you are afraid, okay? Fear sometimes is just as big as we make it seem in our heads. So don't let your fear stop you. The fifth tip I'm sharing is to have a positive mindset. Always be thankful for what you have and for how far you've come, realizing realizing that your life could be worse than what it is right now. Being positive also means forgiving yourself for all of the past mistakes that you've made, for all of the wrong choices that you've made that you think has kept you or has brought you to where you are right now. Forgive yourself for all of those past mistakes and it will help you to look towards the future with renewed optimism and that helps with self-belief. Let me know in the comments what your favorite tip is. Give this video a thumbs up if it was helpful. Share with your loved ones so they can learn a thing or two. Subscribe to my channel as well if you want more videos like this. And make sure your notification bell is always turned on so you don't miss out on any of my uploads. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!